Frequency response analysis application extracts open loop response of a closed loop system using modified Middlebrooks method. The PSPICE design sample used in this demonstration is available in your ORCAD installation under PSPICE capture samples directory. In this example, a voltage source is used to inject a signal into the loop. The signal is injected at a high impedance point to keep the current gain close to zero. The FR ethical application discussed later is coded with this assumption. The circuit is sweeped on frequency parameter for transient analysis. The circuit is set up for bias point calculation and a number of SPICE directives required for simulation are added on design schematic. All comments starting with PSPICE directive get added to the PSPICE netlist. The transient analysis is specified with expression for t-stop value. The directives also specify control on min sim points. This provides the resolution for each transient simulation in the suite. In this example, the min sim points directive generates 1000 points for each simulation run irrespective of the t-stop value. The example also introduces a new operator p on probe statement. This adds parameter value into the pSpice dat file for use by FRA tickle application. Simulating this design generates multiple sections for different frequency parameter values. The frequency response tickle application may be invoked from pSpice tools menu. This application post processes the transient data and generates gain with phase values for sweeped frequency spectrum. The tickle code of this application is an excellent example that demonstrates many ORCAD tickle capabilities. Simple tickle code integrates computation code with the HTML dialog. The code demonstrates reading of transient data from pSpice dat file where each of the block corresponds to a section of data for a particular frequency. The application also generates a new pSpice dat file with gain and phase values for corresponding frequencies which is used for plotting final output of this application. The following code generates equidistant time points from transient data. This example uses spline interpolation. Tickle math library allow selection from a variety of interpolation methods. The value of voltages at two nodes are averaged and Fourier analysis is performed while eliminating the average value from the signal. This code allows the Middlebrooks method to be applied to non-linear switching circuits like switch mode power supplies. To execute the application, select the nodes where test signal has been injected. In our case, the DAT file name remains default. The application calculates the value of gain and phase for each of the frequency points. The board plot for gain and phase may be plotted using plot window templates. In this example, we demonstrated the tickle application execution in user interface mode. The gain and phase computation tickle code could also be executed as a batch mode application. For further information on ORCAD pSpice, please contact your local sales representative or visit us at ORCAD website at www.cadence.com